have seen Mission Impossible Fallout. Mission Impossible Fallout stars Tom Cruise, Henry Cavill, Simon Pegg, Vin Rams, and Rebecca Ferguson. It's directed by Christopher McQuarrie, who also directed the, the last one. This one is about a mission gone wrong. Tom Cruise and his people are on the run, and they need to save the day. The Mission Impossible franchise is probably one of my favorite franchises working today. It's, it's, it's my favorite action franchise working today, period. And what I liked about this franchise is each film until now was directed by a different director. So each film has its own style. And except for the second one, each film gave us a good story and great action. So I was interested to see how this film is gonna play out because it was directed by the same director of the last film and I can say this is the best action movie of the year so far and probably one of the best action film of the last two years this is my favorite action film since Mad Max Fury Road it makes every action movie of this year and maybe the last few years look like kids playing in the playground from the very first shot, the film looks amazing. The direction of this film is fantastic. The cinematography of this film is gorgeous. You get a lot of J.J. Abrams trademarks, the flares in the frames from the light bulbs from behind. It looks so cool. Every action scene is so well choreographed and so well filmed you get those wide shots it is the best stunt work of Henry Cavill until now and there is a fight scene in a toilet and it was so well filmed with those wide shots and you get Henry Cavill that just beat the shit out of somebody it looks so good and so real and let's talk about Tom Cruise stunt work because holy shit those stunt works are jaw-dropping. It's insane. There were shots in this film that it made me shiver in the best way. If you've seen the trailers, you can know different stunts that he did in this film, like jumping out of rooftop and driving against traffic without any helmet on a motorcycle. Oh, it. It's insane! There is this amazing long takes with Tom Cruise just run towards a rooftop and just jumping out of it and it was everyone in the audience who just the acting is great this is why I go to see those films because the characters and the acting and all this brotherhood between Sam Peng and Ving Rhames and Tom Cruise it looks so authentic and so real and I just loved it because you can see this friendship between them like we know each other for a very long time from the very first scene the tension and the suspense is built and built and built and it just doesn't stop the pacing of this film is excellent not one sin not one sin that will bore you every sin is filled with suspense and tension the first 15 minutes of this film are pure suspense I'm not kidding the characters actually feel vulnerable you feel that there are consequences in this line of work you you feel that they can be hurt they can be injured they are injured. I like how the script places different characters in different places to create tension. And the villain is excellent, is one of the best of the entire franchise. Philip Seymour Hoffman is still the best in my opinion, but I think this is the second one, which lead me to the issues. The film doesn't involve the villain as much as I would like. The villain is not that much involved with the film. 
it's it's a great villain but they could have given him a little more screen time M maybe make him involved a little bit but he makes the job it, he's a great villain to conclude this is the best action movie of the year one of the best of the last years and maybe the best in the entire franchise I need to see Ghost Protocol but I think this is the best Mission Impossible film until now I'll give Mission Impossible Fallout a 9 just go and see it go and see it right now this weekend I went two hours before the film started to create this video and I couldn't get into the theater but I went two hours prior to the film just to film the entire way to this video guys thank you so much for watching subscribe comment down below if you like the film or not like this video if you did see you next time